A long time ago, just after Adam and Eve had to leave the Garden of Eden, they were very sad about disobeying God. O oh Lord, how do we show our repentance to you, my Lord? Tell me how. You can satisfy me by sacrificing a lamb. Adam and Eve sacrificed the lamb as per God's word. After a while, Adam and Eve had two sons. Their first son was called Cain and their second son was called Abel. Cain was a farmer. He grew vegetables and grains. Abel was a shepherd who looked after the family's herds. If we sacrifice one goat, we can give thanks to all what he has done for us. We can be grateful and all our sins will be forgiven. We need to do this for him. You don't worry. I will sacrifice the lamb as you say, Father. The next day, Abel and Cain built an altar so that they could sacrifice. Abel, are you going to sacrifice as per our father's word? Yes. But I am very much concerned about my sacrifice that it should be special to God. I will choose my best lamb and the dear one to me and I will offer it to God. This is my first sacrifice. What are you saying? Going to sacrifice the lamb which was first born in our cattle? I am sorry, but I don't have heart to lose that. It's hard for me to give up my most prized position. But it is important to me to try and do my best as God had asked. I think you are a bit silly for giving up the best lamb. We need that lamb. God doesn't. I am sure he'd be just as happy if we sacrifice that is not of importance to us. Why does it need to be a lamb at all? I am a farmer. And it's been a great year for my wheat crop. I can't use everything I've grown. I'm just going to burn whichever is surplus. That way, I won't be wasting any. No, you are wrong. We have to sacrifice the one which we love the most. I will do as I decided. God was happy with Abel's gift. But God was not so happy with Cain's gift. Cain became jealous, but God spoke to Cain. Why are you angry at your brother? If you always do what is right, you will be happy. But be careful. Bad thoughts will ruin your life. Learn to control your anger. But Cain did not listen to God. Instead, he blamed his brother. God doesn't love me. He loves only Abel. I cannot stand this. Anyhow, I must get rid of him now. I hate him. As days passed, Cain hated Abel very much until one day he planned a terrible thing. Abel, come with me out into the fields. Sure. Abel loved his big brother and trusted him. And so he walked with his brother out into the fields. And when Cain got Abel out where nobody could see or hear them, he took a rock and killed his brother Abel. When Cain realized what he'd done, Oh God, what have I done? I have killed my own brother. Let me run home, so that I can escape from my father and mother. Cain, where is Abel? Father, I do not know. I am coming straight from the field. The sheep has written without Abel. Will you go out? And find Abel. While Cain went out, the Lord spoke. How would I know? Am I supposed to take care of my brother? 
but god knew the terrible thing cain had done cain how could you be so cruel to your only brother he has done nothing but try his best for me for his parents and for you i see your brother's blood on the ground because you have spilled your brother's blood into the ground the ground won't grow your crops for any more from now on you will have to wander in far away places to find your food lord the punishment is too hard for me my relatives will try to kill me when they hear what i have done i must always escape from them i will put a mark on you to be protected when anyone see this they would know not to kill you and that god is watching you on a sad sad day cain left his home and family but worse than that god would not be with him any more that was the hardest cain went away and lived in the land of nod <laughs>